mahilig talaga niya ang pagbabasa, kaya naman maging sa sarili niyang tahanan, may private library. Halos isang milyong libro raw ang pagmamayari niya at lahat ng ito ay nabasa na niya. And a huge, huge, ang, ang laki pala itong library. Yes. Oo nga. I love this library. Yes. I stay here most of the time. And uh, it's really just one-fourth of my total number of books. Mm -hmm. Or uh, the others? Another fourth are in my basement. Mm -hmm. And then the other half is in my law office. Look at this. This is all just ventilated by ceiling fans. Yes. But, but I can air con it like this. Ah. Oh, yeah. And then uh, very easily. Beautiful. I oh, oh, nga. Oh, there it is. Uh-uh. Yes. aircon. So I'm completely I'm completely enclosed yes. here. There are no yes. distractions whatsoever. This is where I do my most important work. Do you employ uh, a regular librarian to no. do all of this? No, I have it all in my head. In I your know head? It. <laughs> yes. I know when someone took one book and I'll take a throw a to I have a fit. Okay, what's your favorite book? Well, I like historical fiction, so I cannot say that there's just one book. Uh -oh. But in all, I like Tolstoy. Tolstoy. I like the Russian writers, mm -hmm. writers like Turgenev, Dostoevsky, etc. Mm -hmm. But in in terms of genre, the the specific kind of writing, I like historical novels. Mm -hmm. I really love because mm -hmm. you can sort of go back to that to that life. Uh -huh. You can sort of leave yes, your yes, physical yes, body yes. and go back to that kind of life yeah. you were living. So I love that. Is that an accomplished writer, si Miriam? Sa katunayan, marami na siyang naisulat na libro tungkol sa law, sa political science at maging sa philosophy. 